Hi, welcome to my video on the Atom Tech Bluetooth Selfie Stick Pro. Atom Tech comes in a box like this, and I bought this off Amazon for $24.99. It's a plain box with the word Atom Tech written on the front. There's nothing on either side. At the top, it says Atom Tech. And on the back, we have a picture or line diagram of the selfie stick when it's enclosed and when it's open. The close length of the Atom Tech is seven inches and the actual diameter of the selfie stick is one inch. The selfie stick has this pipe-like design. The bottom half of the selfie stick is made of plastic for the legs because it is a three-in-one selfie stick tripod. We have a plastic collar here which uh, the legs pivot on and we have the body of selfie stick up here that is made of aluminium. We have a removable shutter button here which is, has, which is USB charged so it doesn't run off a battery. You have to charge this but we'll come to that later. And then with inside the body, we have the clamp that holds your phone. Being of a pipe design, to get at the clamp, to clamp your phone on, you simply pull up from the top, which reveals the clamp. And as you keep pulling, it reveals the actual selfie stick itself that comes out. And the actual stem of this selfie stick is made out of aluminium with these black collars um, between each section and it is made up of five sections altogether. I'll start off with the clamp at the top on this Amtec. The clamp is made of plastic. We have this rubber at the top and rubber at the bottom which is ergonomically shaped for mobile phones and the clamp can take any size mobile phone from your mini phones all the way up to your large phones. So that can be fitted in here. Also, with this particular clamp, it almost has a 360 degree turn. So your phone can be either in um, port landscape or turned to portrait. So th that is really good from Antec. It has a slender design. The actual arm of the clamp is made of plastic and it comes down to this nice mount, which I like, which is made out of steel, which is on this aluminium stem. And I like how they put and placed in there a crosshead screw in there. So once this starts to wear down, which I, which I like, when it starts to wear down, you can actually use a crosshead screwdriver to tighten that screw up. This is how the Amtec looks when it's fully extended. Now, Amtec claims that the actual entire length of this is well, they say it's 31.2 inches, but when I measured it, it's 32 inches from the very top to the very bottom. But as you know, in my videos, I do not go by that because that to me is not the true extension length because you lose um, inches off at the bottom for the handle and you lose inches off for the phone mount. So the actual true extension length is the actual stem itself. And between the top of the mount, which is only a tiny mount, to the top of the handle here, it measures um, 21 inches in extension length. I'll do the wobble test on this. And I have to say there is no wobble and no feeling like this is gonna snap in half. And each particular section is fully extended. And I have to say it is quite firm and quite sturdy. Atom Tech has this nice stem which I said be stated before that comes out into five sections. Each section of the stem has these nice black collars that fit in with the nice matte black finish of the stem, which is made out of aluminium. The stem at the front has a seam and at the back it also has a seam that gives it strength. So your heavy phones will go on this no problem. The body of the selfie stick is made of aluminium here and we have this Bluetooth shutter button with its own little kind of recess where it places and it's removable. So we simply 
remove it out like this. Now this Bluetooth shutter button, and I'll come more about it later on how to connect it to your phone, but it's a it's about one and a half inches in length. It's not one that uses a separate battery, so you it has a built-in battery, so you have to charge it with the cable provided, which is a US USB to US, micro USB cable. And it, I have to say, it's a good quality cable that they provide you with, so, and it's just over 12 inches long, so that's not bad. The Bluetooth shutter button simply clips into this recess here, like so, and you'll hear it snap in, and it snaps in there. So we come down now to the words Amtec, which is written on this collar here, as you can see, and that is the collar for the legs because this is a three-in-one um, selfie stick, so it's, and it has its own tripod with it. Now the legs are made out of plastic and there is no dimpling or pattern on these legs, which is a bit of a shame because when you, if you use this in hot weather and you get sweaty hands, this is gonna feel like a bar of soap. So that's really a shame that Amtec didn't put a pattern on these legs. The legs open out like so. And one thing I like with these legs, even though they're made of plastic, and also that they do not have a kind of webbing inside, but they have these kind of bars inside to give it adequate strength. And they are made of a thick plastic but they provided you with these nice kind of cross members here, which are made out of aluminium and they're colored in gun metal gray, just like the actual mount at the top. And I like that because that gives it really good stability. Now this has been outside and I've used this for a week and in a bit of a breeze, there's practically, um, no wobble and this has such a very good footprint on the ground but I'll come to that later on. This is how the Anton Tech, <laughs> what a name, looks when it's when the legs are fully extended out and the stem is fully um, extended up. <laughs> this is how it looks. Now as I said before I had this out in a slight breeze and it kept its own. Now I have to admit that I have a iPhone mini on there and it, it kept it, it didn't feel like it was gonna tumble over uh, in that particular breeze. But as I always say, when you have a selfie stick tripod, please try and tether it because winds can change just like that and you could have a sudden gust and it will just topple over and you don't wanna break your screen on your phone so please tether it if you can or try and or try and use it at halfway but I have to say because of the struts at the bottom which I showed you already it does make these legs quite firm and it does sit quite low to the ground and it does have a big footprint as well to pair the Bluetooth button of the Amtec Amutec Oh, no, no, no. I'm just going to call it the tech, right? <laughs> to pair it, you simply, whether you've got an Android phone or an iPhone, you simply put your, you go to the Bluetooth. If it's an Android phone, make sure that your phone is discoverable so it can see this. Um, iPhone users don't have to do that. Now, you do a five second press on this button, on the shutter button and it will show a green light that will start to flash. Once it's flashing on your iPhone or Android phone, it will come up as an, ant, you, Antum Tech or whatever it's called. It will come up there, it's hard to show it folks, but it will come up like that on there. You click to pair it, it will ask you do you want to pair. You don't have to enter any numbers, just touch to pair and it will pair automatically. The shutter button, takes one hour to charge, to give it a full charge. And it has a 50 milliamp battery in there, milli, milliamp hour battery in it. So, which is capable of what I read in the book, on the instruction book, it's capable, and which I forgot to show you, it does come, I'm absolutely fingers and thumbs today. 
he does come with an instruction book like so. So in there, it says that the button is capable up to 15,000 shots before it needs recharging. Now I've had this all week and I only charged it once. So it looks like I have not reached the 15,000. So that's what it needs. We'll see if the shutter button is muted in the phone or not, or if we can hear the shutter button when pressed. Because so, certain, certain shutter buttons are muted by the phone. So we'll press the shutter button on this photo and see if we can hear it. And as you can hear, it doesn't mute it and we'll do it for video. And it doesn't for video. So the phone doesn't mute the sound of the shutter button. Just in case you're wondering, the shutter button has a five minute sleep function. So if it's not being pressed after five minutes, it will shut down to simply wake the shutter button up again. You just simply press on the button to wake it up and to pair it back to your Bluetooth after when it shuts down, you just simply press and your phone will reconnect back to the button automatically. Now we come to the part of the video where I give my two pence worth on the Atom Tech or Tech Bluetooth Selfie Stick Pro. And I'll start off with the negatives first. The first negative has to be with the Atom Tech or Tech has to be with the handle here, stroke legs. It is very, very smooth. And considering that it's made out of plastic, there is no kind of pattern on these legs whatsoever. So um, if you have sweaty palms, this is gonna feel like a bar of soap in your hands. The next negative has to be with not the feet or the legs. Incidentally, even though I forgot to tell you that these legs have um, rubber ends to them, but it's not that, it's the opening of these legs. Now I have opened legs from other tube stroke soft sticks that are free in one like this shape, and they were easy to open. This one, it's a bit tricky now. It could be just a one-off with this particular um, soft stick that I've got, and when you purchase yours, it may be totally different, but it is a bit stiff to open these legs out and it's a bit tricky. And you do have to bear in mind to open the legs out at the bottom, you're gonna have to release the clamp at the top and bring that up a little bit and then open these legs out. Because as you open the legs out, as you can see, the actual clamp and stem goes up. So be aware of that. Negative has to do with the price. As I stated at the beginning of my video that this is $24.99 from Amazon and that's in the UK. And I have done reviews on other pipe design such as the Magic Pipe, which is I think 15 pounds if I remember rightly for that particular one. This is a bit overpriced. This needs to be in that region for $24.99 it brings it almost into the region of um, selfie, um, selfie sticks such as Smart Tree. It brings it into that region and the build quality is not as good as Smart Tree. Another negative has to be with the shutter button. Some people will find that as a negative because it doesn't rely on a battery as such as a removable battery. You have to charge this up. But as I stated, it does give you 15,000 presses of this button um, before it dies, before it requires another charge. Now, I haven't tested it to 15,000, but that's what it claims in the instruction book. And now for the positives. Positive has to be with this mount at the top here where it meets the clamp. I love how they provided you with a nice metal mount as this with a as I said, we call it over here in the UK, Phillips head, um, probably throughout the world, they call it a cross head screw there. And I like how they provide you with that because over time, as you're moving this uh, clamp at the top of the stem, it will begin to wear down because it's basically plastic against metal. So at least you have the facility, the ability to tighten that up. 
the positive has to be this shutter button now as i place it in the negatives and i'm also going to place it in the positive that it has a you charge this shutter button it doesn't rely on a removable battery and also the cable that you get with it is a micro usb cable and it is a good quality cable positive has to go for these legs of the amtec i like how they provided it gave you these nice aluminium struts between each leg to give it um, more stability and sturdiness on the ground so that's great the positive i do like is this clamp at the top here that it has the ability to go from landscape to portrait with a simple turn which is great and also it has one of the most quietest spring mechanisms in there and quite strong as well and this nice ergonomic shape to fit your phones this is my overall conclusion of the Amtec Bluetooth selfie stick pro this is not a bad selfie stick all in one especially it's three all in one but the thing that lets this down which to me is the biggest letdown of this is its price at $24.99 now considering that Blitzwolf and also Magic Pipe which I think are the original designers of the pipe design of a 3-in-1 um, they're a lot cheaper than this they come around between the 15 to 18 pound mark and the quality is just as good as this so that's the only thing that lets this down and otherwise it is a good selfie stick to have to take on holiday and days out if you happen to have the Amtec, I hope I got that one right. I've got a funny thing of saying that wrong. If you happen to have this selfie stick, please leave down in the comment section what you think about it because obviously your opinions are different to my opinions and I haven't said that for quite a while. So I'll leave that down in the comment section. Thanks for watching the video. If you like it, give it a thumbs up. If you don't like it, give it a thumbs down. I perfectly understand my videos can be long but I like to go into detail on the item or the product so when you get it, you know what to expect. Please subscribe to my channel if you like the channel. I'll be grateful for that and I'll see you next time.